Is that anybody else's favorite sound? It's definitely mine. It's your favorite. Now we can leave this city. Let's drive to the open air. Yeah, the countryside is so pretty. With the wind blowing in your hair. We can look back someday. So something new that we want to start on our channel is like a tool time segment. A lot of people have shown interest in the products that we use, whether it be our welder, our filtration system, the UV light, um, to our washer and dryer, to our portable power stations. And we want to be able to do these products justice, so whether it's sponsored or not sponsored, we're going to start doing a tool time segment video. Also, I've been trying to think of a name for this all day long. So if you have any cool names, please drop them in the comments. I think like Cool Tech with Cody or Tool Tech with Cody or I don't know, something along those lines. Let me know what you think, drop your ideas. We will never bring you any sort of sponsorship or deal that we don't personally love, tried out, and swear by. And especially for this tool time segment, we will never bring you a product that we don't absolutely love because we want this to be a learning place for other homesteaders or other people that are doing DIY home build projects to feel safe and to be able to just learn about the products that we love and have used and work well for us. But our very first segment um, happens to be sponsored by Anchor. And so we're super excited because Anchor has honestly been such a lifesaver to us. We use our Anchor from literally straightening my hair to washing my clothes to vacuuming my house. So let's talk about it. So if you don't know who Anchor is or you haven't used any Anchor products, you're missing out. But it is the world's number one mobile charging brand. And they're number one for a reason. Yeah, for sure. So they have live PO4 batteries and they have the most advanced charging technology. So this thing will go from completely dead to 80% full in just an hour. And for how big of a battery it is, that's honestly pretty crazy. The live PO4 batteries remain in a healthy state even after 3,000 complete charge cycles with six times longer battery lifespan than the industry's average, which is pretty huge especially in today's technology. It has a built-in 1500 watt inverter and then the battery capacity is 1229 watt hours. So it's got plenty of power to run anything from like a refrigerator to even our washer and dryer. So prior to getting um, a more advanced solar setup, which we will hopefully have a video for you um, soon, we actually used the 757 powerhouse station to run our entire house overnight. So we obviously didn't want to run the generators all night because super loud and it used a lot of gas yes so we would plug the house into the power station then it would allow us to be able to turn the lights on still run the TV and have the refrigerator still run through the night without having to pull on our small house solar batteries and worry about them being dead or damaging them by the morning time and it kept the cell phone booster on so I was happy but the most important thing that I use the anchor for is our laundry. I don't know what's going on with our washer. I kind of think it's because it's got a computer chip in it and more sensitive electronics, but the generator or the house power inverter does not want to run it. So it continuously just kept shutting off whenever we would uh, start the washer and try to do a load of laundry and we couldn't figure out why. So, so we decided to try to plug it into the anchor and it actually worked perfectly fine. So, still don't know what's going on as far as the generator or the inverter for the house goes, but the anchor has been able to do all of our laundry with no issues. So yes. that's been great for us. Um, I am a person who is very OCD, so when I can't clean, vacuum, do laundry, basic things like that, I get really overstimulated, I should say. So this has been a lifesaver. And the cool thing about that is it has AC bypass feature too. So you can actually use the power station while it's plugged into the house charging, or it can do a pass through to where it's still using power from the generator, not the actual battery, but it kind of acts like a filter to make it more of a clean electricity. So we can still charge it from the house and the generator and keep it 100% charged while the dryer and washer is plugged into it, and it'll be able to keep it running perfectly fine. And with the Anchor, you can rest assured and have some peace of mind because... It's got a five-year warranty on the Anchor itself, and then the Life PO4 battery inside of it has a 10-year warranty. 
It's quite heavy, but that's okay because it has a dual grip design. So even though I can't lift a whole lot, it's super easy to carry around where I need it. That's not all. It has a noiseless cooling fan, smart power saving mode, and a cool LED light bar that if your house is dead and you need to see really quickly, you can pop that thing on so you're not walking around and bumping into walls. Yeah, it's been a big lifesaver whenever the generator dies unexpectedly. And not that I would recommend dropping it, but it has an automotive grade aluminum frame on it, so it makes it pretty heavy duty. And hey, maybe your power capacity isn't as big of a need as ours. So I would highly encourage you to look into the Anchor 521 and 535. These powerhouses have the same long lasting batteries at a smaller capacity. So that could fit your needs. And if you're off grid like us, or maybe you're camping somewhere that doesn't have any AC outlets, you can still charge it via their solar panels or your own solar panels, or you can even plug it into your car and still charge it that way. Check out the link in our description as well as our discount code to get your very own Anchor power house like I said we use this thing a ton and it has been a lifesaver for us and honestly we were without it for two days um, and honestly my world came crashing down it was <laughs> it was insane okay I was very stressed out so we left it at his mother's house charging because we happened to be there and could do laundry <laughs> I was very stressed out. So thank you to Anchor for sponsoring today's video. And we hope to be able to bring you one of these each week. Comment products that you want to see. Comment names that you think that we should um, title this segment to our channel. And yeah, I hope that we can help other DIY homesteaders, um, you know, with products that may be beneficial for their homestead. That we only get one love on one.